Don't be that one now, eh? The whole life. Now my girl, let me know now where my other come up. What this iPhone user has with low battery? Eh? Wait. Who the? Who the? Who the? Who the? Who the? Who the? Ah, native. I talk I'm native. All those small small boys where they this area. May they come, may I change that for them. Eh? Natif. Ah, Oibo. Hey! No, we you the new TikTok. Eh? I tell you, I tell you, yeah. Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! I don't have difficulty in breathing again. Thanks for your care. You're welcome. About this, are you asthmatic as well? No, but my kid sister is. She was here a while back. We had to get her a couple and she forgot this one and she left. Plus I thought it would um, be better to bring you here since it's um, closer to the point of crisis. That's, that's thoughtful and kind of you. Quite thoughtful. You're welcome. Thank you once again. It's okay. Um, do I get you no, something? No, 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 no. I'm fine. I'm very well, thank you. Not even water? Not to worry. I'm fine. Uh, please. Could you do me a favor? I would like to go with this. I would like to have it in my car up until I get to my hotel. Just in case, you know, these things can 
It's fine, you can keep it. Uh, no, but I promise to return it before the day runs out. Okay, if that's what you want. It's okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, it feels All right, take it easy. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, take it easy. Slow the car down. Slow down, slow down, slow down. You see this bond? Oh, dear. This guy is a swine. <sighs> Thank God I got the number plates. You know what? Just turn the car around, turn it around, turn it. Take me back to the house, yes. I need to show Barry right away. Um, I'll return this. Just, um, just um, take it easy and drive safe. Yeah, yeah, sure. Thank you. Is that the door is open? Uh, uh, babe, do you want to break down these doors? Very, 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 very. You would not believe this. What happened? Bond happened. What are you talking about? Bond went to Abuja with the 7 a.m. flight to keep up with a business appointment. Are you talking about this appointment? Go ahead. What's this? That's a video of yours truly, Bond. Mm-hmm. On my way to the airport to catch a flight to Lagos, I saw Bond. Same Bond, you are saying he's in Abuja, right? For business meeting, appointment, whatever. You are pulling my legs, aren't you? Okay. Okay, let's assume I'm pulling your legs. But the Uber driver I came with is still downstairs. That's I actually made the video from inside his car. So baby, let's let's just go. Let's go see him, then he will tell you if you don't believe me. Yeah, let's go, darling. Let's just go. <sighs> These things happen. You mean Bond lied to me. He lied to me that he had a business trip in Abuja so he could cheat on me with this. With the... Well, you could see everything. I don't know. These things happen. Couples cheat, you know. Two months. Right. Two months to avoid it.
headed to Barry's place to tell her about my cancelled um, trip to Abuja before running into gold. Obi, uh, Oga, open the gate. Okay, I don't close up. Open the gate. Oga, what you got to do here? We have to pray. My organic prayer, every spirit of backwardness. Backwardness. How can a man come back and see he's going back again? Something is wrong with my organ. Jesus. Holy Ghost fire. I come against every evil spirit. Spirit of backwardness. It don't come up for you, though. Okay, don't come out. Something is wrong. For God's sake, stop being this childish and emotional. Don't you? Don't you dare. Don't you dare mock my pain. Listen, don't you dare insult my heart's break. Don't you dare. No. No. Oh, what are you doing? What exact? Are you trying to call Bond to find out if I lied to you? Exactly what I chucked when I risked missing my flight just to come show you this video physically instead of sending it to you virtually. Wow, Barry. You're more naive than I thought. Lucy! Stop the screaming bullshit and listen to me. Girlfriend, you need to wake up. You need to wake up. Stop this good girl act you have going with Bond. Wake up before some other lady takes him away from you. Perry, after all you did to get him to commit to you, you suddenly went to sleep. There's so many spinsters out there ready to fight for a handsome and rich dude like Bond. You can't just sit here and be crying and feeling pity for yourself. Fight for your man. <sighs> Lucy, what do you have me to? Simple. Stop giving Bond the impression that you love and need him more than he loves and needs you. This is the 21st century, darling. No woman who wants respect and stability in her relationship bends over in every circumstances. You have to tell your man how you want to be treated as a lady. Yes. Huh. Barry. Come on, girl. You have to bite. It's high time you started showing Bond and any other lady who decides to, to, to run along with him that you are in no-nonsense territorial lioness. Yes, darling. And you have to do this with that girl in the video. Start with her. Bite, girl. Bite. Baby, it's not easy. Girlfriend, please. Please just help me with an idea. My head is so messed up right now. Just help me come up with something. I don't it's know what's... It's your fight, girl. It's your fight. You have to fight for your man. Listen, I don't know what you, what you need to do, but you need to really think of something, you know, and think really fast while you're at it, okay? 
just try to think, execute the plan. Don't wait one more second because that can be very, very, very dicey. Yes, bond is your territory. And the lady in that video is the stray dog who dabbled into your territory. Mm-hmm. Wake up, darling. Chase it away. Hang it if you must. Mm-hmm. Yes, you, you understand what I mean, right? Pretty simple. As for me, I have a flight to catch. You remember, right? My Uber driver is still downstairs, okay? Uh, I trust you. I know you can do this. But let's not forget, let me just send the video to you so you can watch it over and over again. That will help you make a perfect plan. Yes, it will help you. It will give you ideas on what you need to do, okay? Alrighty. Mm. Yeah. Oh, scent. Yes, I trust you, okay? So stop crying, okay? You don't need all of this. You're a big girl now. Take care of this once and for all, okay? I have to go. Just take care and stop crying, okay? I love you, darling. Bye. Oh. Okay, okay, if you insist. All right, I'll let you have it your way. But are you sure you'll be able to find your way to my place? All right, of course, the map will help. All right, all right. Okay, I will see you in a bit. Um, I don't need to call Barry, do I? No. I'll just make myself a meal and go to Lucy's place after and surprise her like I planned earlier. I can't wait to see the look on her face when she sees me with her favorite bowl of ice cream, of course. Hi. Sorry, eh, but Oga, eh? Oga? What? 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 Obi, what? How hard is it to just close your mouth, open the gate, and close it? How hard is it? Please, I'm not in for your talks. Please. Okay. Yes, sir. I'm not in a spiritual problem. They don't get my ogre. They get my ogre, they don't get me. Eh? No, baby. I can't keep the inhaler. I promised to return it. But you should be resting after such a... Baby... I will rest when I return to the hotel, okay? But first things first. Let me return the inhaler, please. Baby, I still am not comfortable with you being outside again so soon after having the kind of crisis you described to me. I told you that I'm fine now. As a matter of fact, I'm on my way. I'm on my way to return his inhaler. I promised and I've got integrity so I have to keep to my promise, okay? Oh, in that case, you should go ahead. Give my regards to him. Thank you. I will. I 
love you. I love you too, sweetheart. join me I could no 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 it's fine I had breakfast already thank you oh, great um like I said over the phone that I was going to come express my gratitude for saving a soul today mm. and to give you the inhaler myself oh, come off it you, you need to stop I mean you've thanked me enough already you make it seem like it's not something that happens on a daily Plus, who knows, in the near future, I might be in your position and you in the opposite position. I'm sure you would be rendering help. That's how life rolls. You're such a perfect gentleman. Thank you. And indeed, that's how life rolls. Okay, one second. Here you have it. And thank you once again. Thank you. I'll be on my way now. Um, one sec, please. Um, I'm curious to know. Okay. Um, I mean, the attack seemed a bit um, severe. But what triggered it? Well, the air in the GR is, is pretty clear. Yeah, the air is pretty clear. Okay, what happened was that earlier this morning, someone started um, a fire, probably someone in the neighborhood who wanted to burn his um, household trash. Then I jogged past it and I inhaled the smoke. Boom! It triggered it. Wow. That's a funny coincidence. I mean, I remember something like that almost, you know, taking the life of my kid sister. So, oh, so sorry. Years back. I mean, it's quite a shame how we treat these things in this part of the world. I mean, people just carelessly burning things without them paying attention to the health hazards it may pose to people, unsuspecting um, occupants in the neighborhood. It's really sad. I absolutely do agree with you. And I would suggest they get enlightened by public health officials yeah. as well. You know, my boyfriend was actually very mad at whoever started that fire. He was like, um, things like this don't happen abroad. It, you don't just go about igniting or starting fire on the streets. He's very correct. I mean, there are serious consequences for offenders, you know. Um, that's what happens when a system works and not disrupted by systemic corruption like we have here. Mm -hmm. I agree with you once again. Lucy, calm down. I'm already on my way to his house. <laughs> you know, everything just done on me the moment you left the house. You are right all along. I have been too calm and too naive with Bond. <laughs> Babe, trust me. If Bond did not call you to beg you to beg me on his behalf, then call me a dog. Yes, of course. <laughs> you said if I get there and meet the so-called girl there, <laughs> then the third world war will break out. Yes, I said that. Babe, they know they use proverb, they talk this kind thing. You should know what's up. You know what? Just thank you so much for opening my eyes. I am super grateful, okay? I, I, I should be learning along now. Uh, all right, thank you. This cab guy, now where is he? I thought you said he's here. Hurry up, hurry up. I'll have to go now, okay? And talk to you. 
Hope you don't mind um, I call you, you know, from time to time. That won't be necessary, sir. No, no, no it's don't, not. Don't even argue about it, please. Okay. Um, I needed to come say thank you. And for some personal reasons, I wouldn't want this to go beyond what it is already. I understand and I respect that. Um, you did mention, you know, your boyfriend. Oh, yes. Plus, I am taken. Soon to be wedded, actually. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> great, great. Um, that, that's fine. Uh, oh, congratulations in advance. Thank you. Thank <laughs> that's you. fine. Oh, okay. That's okay. In that case, I can entertain some little hellos <laughs> and highs, you know, once in a while. Okay. Yeah, I can. I mean, I jog in the neighborhood every morning whenever I'm in town. So I know I will see more of you. You know, you are, you are a decent lady. The kind I would want my fiancé to be around. Oh. Yes. Absolutely. Jesus Christ. Barry, hey, babe. Oh, <laughs> baby, it's not what you think. Um, I, uh, let me explain. So it's true. How dare you? How dare you insult our love so you could be with this thing? Barry, excuse me. You need to How dare you? you? Relax. How Barry, dare you? you need to How could you do this? Barry, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? How can you do this for me? Barry, you need to stop it. How dare you? How dare you? Barry! Barry, don't touch that lady! Gates, man! Gates, man! Open the gates! Open the gates! Open the gates! Baby, please. Don't. Don't. Baby, please. Baby, please. Don't make me do something I will regret. Get out. Get out. Get out. Baby, baby, no, I love you. Take out of okay, my You get out now. Baby, please. Baby, I said leave. Madame, is it? Baby, please. Imagine the barbarian. Baby. Now listen to me. If I see her in this compound again, you will go with her. Hey. Why? Why? This thing a temptation. This man. Hey, they know they break bottle for GRA. This place is not GRA. This guy just come from Opoko. Call this place. Call the break bottle. You get locked. You get locked, sir. I don't follow you, best. You get locked, sir. Sir, sir, never shop. I fall. I fall. I fall. I fall. Oh, God. You just get locked. Whip or pull my hand. You go. You go. You go to challenge me here. No sense. Hello? I'm out of the room, girl. Alaji is asleep. <sighs> Babe, I didn't want to annoy him by waking him up with this phone call. <sighs> it's okay, it's okay. So tell me, what did you say 
you did to bond? Okay, I've heard that part before, and I completely agree with what you did. Yes, seeing that bitch with him, of course she'd drive you mad. Any woman will be driven to rage, yes. And I totally support you, darling. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Come on, girl. I understand. But you continuing the drama, even after you have wounded Bond, that was, girlfriend, that was too much. You went too far. Barry, why, why, why would you? That would, you went too far. L Lucy, I did not call you for you to blame me, okay? Yes, I made a mistake. But I continued to go after that bitch, even after I injured Bond. But my reaction in that house is no drama. So don't you say. Call is that. I met my man, the love of my life, with another woman in his house two months before our wedding. It's no drama. That is actually an insult from him. A very disrespectful provocation, Lucy. Okay, I withdraw the word drama. You're right. It's an outrageous insult. What you met there in Bond's house. And you did quite right by not giving him your ear for any form of explanation. Come on, girl. That he never called you to say that he was in town till you got to his house, rendered whatever explanation he wanted to give you useless. Mm -hmm. He would have lied you numb as all cheating men do if you'd listened to him. And the bitch he was cheating on you with would have totally lost respect for you. Yes. She would have taken you for granted and continued to push you till you become history in Bond's head and life if you reacted less forcefully. Exactly. Bond's reaction scared me and still scares me, Lucy. I have never seen him like this. He has never raised his voice at me. No. Lucy, even threatening to cut me off the way he did today. I have called him more than 20 times. He didn't pick my call and he hasn't called back. After he drove me out of his compound. Lucy, I have never seen Bond like this before. I am more scared. Then I am angry right now. <sighs> Babe, please. Please advise me. I don't know what to do. <sighs> please. Okay, okay. T take a deep breath. Yes, just calm down. Calm down, girl. Listen, go back to his house. Dramatize your remorse like you have never dramatized anything in your life. Yes. Get him to listen to you by fire, by force. Mm-hmm. Of course, baby girl. Play on every one of his weaknesses. Especially his obsession with blowjob. Mm-hmm. You know, go make heaven, Lucy. I swear down. <laughs> but what you advise me can only happen if I can successfully gain access into his house. What if that lousy idiot manning his gate refused to let me into his compound as he instructed him? Darling, you have his baby in your womb. Mm-hmm. Yes. How does that come into play here? 
Oh, Barry, why do I have to explain everything explicitly to you? Come on. Listen, you yourself used that same pregnancy to manipulate him and convince him to accepting you after a long hesitation from him. And he committed to you, did he not? Uh huh, he did. So it's simple. You will use that same pregnancy, okay? Go back to his house. Hmm? Right? Get him to throw the door wide open for you. Use that pregnancy. Convince him. Grow the anything you need, anything you have to do, just do it. Okay? Use that pregnancy to manipulate him once again. And darling, if he doesn't throw the gate and his door wide open for you, <laughs> then I have wasted my precious time studying psychology in school. And the bitch he messed with me with. Barry, that one a little parole now. Eh? You too do. Leave that one for one side first. Hmm? Listen, girl. We'll deal with that one later when I get back. We'll trace her. We'll put the fear of you deep into her. Right. Yes, darling. And we'll make sure that when she hears or sees your shadow, she'll be shivering. So just leave that one. Go repair the damage. Your very own action cost your relationship. And when, we, when I come back, that girl will just be a fly. And she will cost the day she saw your man. My darling, I bet me your paro no spoil my own paro, yeah? Make I go around my own package. Later now. Love you, girl. <laughs> Bye. Ah, very young wahala. For this! Abby! Abby! Who be that? Obi, don't be silly and open the gates. Get a renke. Eh, Obi, get a renke. Don't be silly, open the gates for me. Uh, um, yellow berry. Now you see, eh? No, be today. Oh. If my village people don't join your village people, may they do collabo, remis. May I join hard? Do my yoga something when I go do them, making sack me for this for this small business. Why they manage you? Lie, lie, tell them say no go work. You no go work. Obi. Kere renke. Don't be silly. Eh? Stop talking nonsense and open this gate for me. So I'm talking nonsense, eh? Okay, no problem. Yellow Berry, special announcement. This gate is now gate of heaven. And gate of heaven will not open for sinners like you. Today is not judgment day. And no who sense. the hell are you calling a sinner? You, of course. Person where get mine, carry bottle, carry knife, to kutuka a man anyhow, scatter him, tear him, like say, they fight, if they fight Boko Haram. Who the person be? You want me to call you uh, Mary, daughter of Abraham? Eh? Are you not wicked? You're supposed to leave this gate. Go to get off here and try your luck there. Today is not for you. Is it because I'm coming? I'm, I'm coming, coming down. Who is that mad dog barking at the gate? Uh, now, nah, yellow berry. Keep quiet. I wasn't talking to you. I said, who is that mad dog? That miserable dog barking at my gate. What did you just call me? A now? mad dog. That is what you are. Now, listen. You are lucky that Obi did not open this gate for you because if I had found you inside my premises, I would have flung you over the fence without batting an eyelid. Yes. Baby, I'm sorry. Please. I do not want to hear it. Yes. Now, listen to me. I want you far away, far away from this gate. If you so much as tap it, you will unleash and have an encounter with the devil inside of me. Right. Baby. Yes. Correct, baby is no longer about you and I. Eh? It's about our baby. I mean, the heart tackle you gave me earlier today. I've been feeling a burning sensation below my abdomen. Please open the gate so you can take me to the hospital. What? How dare you come here? How dare you try to use the child in you to blackmail me? 
What sort of cheap emotional blackmail is that? Baby, I'm not lying to you. I'm not. What do you mean you're not lying to me? What do you take me for? Some stupid idiot who wants a child so badly that will just jump at anything you say because I'm, because I'm desperate, because I'm senseless? Who, who put you up to this? Who advised you to do this? Baby, baby, no, I love you. Look, look at my hand. Does this look like the work of love? Or the work of a raving mad person? A mad dog? I'm sorry. No, look. Have you traced and apologized to the lady you harassed in this house? The, the lady you assaulted today? I mean. No buts. No Until you do that, I do not ever want to set my eyes on you again. Do not make the mistake of showing up in this premises. You will not like how it will end. Okay. Get out of this place. Baby. Baby. Get out! Baby. Baby. Rubbish! Rubbish! Oga, okay. okay, you're not really the correct man. Oga, okay, you're not a better man. Hey! See action! Hey! Hey, you know, say something to Oga for hand. We just use this one, hold Use this one, Okay, Oga, you're a better person, I swear. Eh? I think they think see na na gentleman, pure gentleman you be. I don't know say you the miss him. You the miss gentleman and regality. Eh? God go bless you. She naked God will join hand with devil and they will bless you well well. Okay, you know go die. You know your money go long. Eh? See all this I shall wanna do cause cause problem for, 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 for this country. Hmm? I still no know waiting God put for that for that apple. Where if? Can he give Adam? Adam come shop him. All of us come to the sofa here. I shall have business come full everywhere. This is a shower, come, come here, come, to, come scatter my yoga hand. Me waste salary. My salary never even end. Today now, na half of the month. I don't carry out my money, give a shower. I don't even see money, buy food, job. I don't even see money, say give, say give my mama for village. No, beside, I don't agree with you. Na small, small shower, I don't carry. But I know the near 5,000, 6,000, I know the near. All this 1,850. Sometimes I go price, 1,000. Four thirds with a bag, plenty a bag. Makufu penyo. Salary agu. Salary agu. Asha wa problem. Oga God go bless you. Na man you be. Na man you be. I swear. No. I'm back in our apartment with my tails in between my legs. Like a damn beaten dog. Baby's all round disaster. You didn't play the my baby's in danger card to him again, did you? I did. But that ended up throwing him off the cliff with so much rage in his eyes. People have never seen born this angry before in his life. He did not only abuse me in front of his gay man. No. He also assaulted me physically. What? Born? assaulted you instead of softening up upon hearing that you're about to lose his baby? Yes. He did not believe me. He thought you'd lie. I have never seen Bond this angry before. He nearly strangled me to death. Do you know what? Bond actually ordered me to go find the bitch, apologize to her, have her forgive me before coming anywhere close to him or his house. Can you imagine that? He said that to you? <laughs> yes. And he said it to my face before pushing me out of his compound for the second time today. Why? Why such madness? I get it. Ladies get irrational and irresponsible when seized by jealousy. But to put on such an act without even speaking with me, it's inexcusable. It's totally inexcusable. 
and then you come to my house not to apologize for the embarrassment but to put up such nonsensical emotional blackmail on me and now Miss Good will not speak with me she won't talk to me after everything I have done Who would? Pray. Pray. I forgive you for this. Pray. I find it in my heart to forgive you for this. world is falling apart. My wedding is in danger and I can feel it. Where in the world am I supposed to find that bitch and do all those things that Bond is insisting? Are you out of your mind, Barry? Find and apologize to a fucking bitch who should be. Uh, uh, no, please, Lucy. Bond referred to her as innocent. Can you beat that? That what, Barry? Don't tell me with that overused men's game. Come on. Bond has so fright frightened you out of your wits that you are now ready to play the fool for him and another woman he cheated on you with. Yes, admitted that you complicated issues with the injury you gave to him. But girlfriend, you are still the one offended in all of this. Look, the table has turned against me. It doesn't matter who is right or who is wrong. I just need you to just... Calm down. We'll find a way to get you and Bond reconciled. But that will not be at the expense of your dignity as a lady, Barry. Hell no! Not on my watch. If you're ever going to trace the bitch, it will not be to apologize to her. It will be to make her regret ever getting close to your man. That's the way it should be, and that's the way it must be. Uh, 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 oh. Pull yourself the fuck together and start using your head and not your heart in this berry. Come on! Do it, or allow me to handle this for you at, from this point. Yes. How? Uh, look. I've called Bond 20 times today. And he hasn't picked any of my calls. In fact, he has blocked me from reaching him on the phone and all his social media handles. Of course I can. Cal, yeah. I will call him myself and get everything sorted out. Trust me, he's gonna call you and apologize to you within the hour. In fact, I'm calling him once this call drops. Mm -hmm. Please do. Please, I need you to save my relationship. Can you just call this call already and just call him and call me back, please? Okay, please, just call him. Please, I'm waiting for your call. All right, thank you. He said he's innocent, although she won't believe. The love they had just feels like yesterday We're pointing fingers down And drifting far apart When I look at you I now see a stranger Oh, What is love without trust? What is miss without you? Take my hand and stand with me Oh, What is love without trust? What is peace without you? Why not choose to be with me? Can we, Can we survive this raging storm? Oh, when you cannot have trust in me. Can we survive, Can we survive this raging storm? When I cannot trust you. We'll see why you call in my life. You know what, on second thoughts, yeah? I have a question for you. 
Did you put Barry up to a stupid display she came to exhibit at my place? I do not care how you feel about the question. Answer me or I'll end this call now. What is this supposed to mean? Did she call you to tell you she was coming to my place on both occasions when she did? Look, she assaulted an innocent female visitor in my house. And I will not have it. Yes, I'm in town. The least she could have done was call me. Or at least listen to my explanation when she, when she ran into me with the lady. How difficult is that? Look, she already knows what to do. If she does, fine. If no, I will never speak with her again or have her come close to me. Are you being silly? Your primary concern is the wedding. The wedding. Did she tell you that she injured me? Did she tell you that? What sort of friend are you? Do you even talk to your friend? Now, listen to me. I'm going to say this one time. I do not want to hear anything whatsoever concerning Barry. So, fuck Barry. Fuck the wedding until she does what is right. Don't call my phone again. Else, I will block you. Hello, Lucy. How did he go? Is he on his way to see me and apologize for all that he said? It seems the situation has gone worse than I was taking it earlier. Uh, how, how do you mean? Bond is so angered by what happened that he did not only refuse to listen to anything I had to tell him, but he also warned me never to try calling him again, else he will block my line too. What? Bond said that to you? How could he talk to my friend with so much disrespect? I mean, who is that bitch I met with him that my womanly jealousy I pulled at his place is driving him crazy. Who is she? Same question on my lips, babes. Whatever. Who she is is not as necessary as the fact that what is going on now? She has become a big clog in your wheel of progress that must be removed urgently. She's a huge threat to your wedding plans, darling. <laughs> Baby, you know what? I think at this point I give up. I will just have to go to Bond, beg him, and ask him to direct me to that bitch, please, so I could apologize to him and save my relationship. I have to do it. You would do no such thing, Barry. No, you will not belittle yourself to that level, not when I'm involved. Lucy, what do you have me do? She will take my man away from me if I don't do it. Not if you act fast to remove her as a factor in the life of you and Bond. How? Listen to me, girl. You will get along with Bond, marry him as planned, and yes, you will go to him to help you trace the bitch. But not the way you wanted to. Mm-hmm. From tomorrow, you will go to him, but you stay off her side. I mean, from tomorrow, you start stalking Bond, so that if and when he meets with that lady again, you will take it from there and get the problem of that little whiny tiny ingrate sorted out once and for all. Wait, I will take it from there. Get the problem of her sorted out 
once and for all. I don't get it. How do you mean? You're not a kid, Barry. Once a man starts cheating on his woman with any lady, for as long as that other lady exists, she will never cease to appear and reappear in his life. You know that too well, Barry. Trace this lady. Apply the same solution I applied to the bitch who tried to come between me and my Swiss base boyfriend two years ago. Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ. You want me to kill her? You want me to commit murder? Do you really want to marry and have a crisis remarried with her? Then call that moral bullshit you're trying to mouth into a blazing fire decisively. Come on, girl. End the shit going on with Bond and the asshole. Life is a jungle. Bond is your own jungle berry. Behave like a jungle tigress in the situation without further delay. Tear, kill, and devour your opponent if you really want to rule long and peacefully in your jungle babes. You ask for my advice. There, you have it. Bye bye. why I was willing to commit to you. Not because you told me you were pregnant, no. I had a proposal all planned out already. Hello, babe. Uh, yeah, I was on my way to you. I'm, I'm, I'm just getting ready to leave the house. Oh, you're already on your way here. Close to the gate already. Is everything okay? Oh, okay, okay. Babe, 
Wait, what's going on? I mean, we were supposed to attend lunch together at the grand opening of the new resort. Supposed to pick you up. You didn't call me before coming, plus I know you're not going out like this. You're not ready. Is everything okay? Okay. Um, why don't you sit down, okay? There is something important I would like to talk about. Okay. Um, you... There is a new development, and I would like you to see it. Then we talk. Okay. <clears throat> what, what's happening there? The answer to your question is inside here. Open it. You're, you're pregnant. You're pregnant. Yes. I was feeling feverish a few days ago and I decided to run a malaria test which came out negative. Then the doctor advised I do need PT. And it's like positive. <laughs> You're pregnant. I'm going to be a father. Babe! This is amazing! Come here! Give me a hug! My love! You're not angry. Why, why would I be? I'm going to be a father. You, you're carrying my child. You're carrying our baby. Why would I be? Why would I be upset? I, I was thinking that you were going to be mad and okay, that maybe I planned it all. Oh, come on! Oh, no. you, you, you've made me the happiest man on earth. You, you're carrying my child. You know what? You know what this news has done? You see, our lunch, it's going to be something bigger. I mean, we have to celebrate this. We're having a child together. Um, we'll go out, we'll go somewhere and make this really big i'm going to tell everybody that i am becoming a father uh, 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 baby no i don't want to go out i'm not feeling strong baby i don't want to go out why don't you just celebrate in the house yes i'll just go to the kitchen grill some chicken and fix us something you really want to do that celebrate indoors yeah uh, okay you, you know what that's fine whatever makes you Happy, my darling. Okay. Um, while you do that, I will quickly step out and you know get us a delicious bottle of wine. Okay, just how you like it. Come here. Love you with all my life. Okay. Wow! Wow! I'm going to be your father. Ho! Oh, let's go! <laughs>
before we start off, uh, something I would like you to know. You're special to me. You know what, I'll just go right into it. Um, Barry, will you marry me? <gasps> yes. Yes, I'll marry you. something about it. I have to. I mean, I can't be having sleepless nights over things like this. Okay, I don't know what to do. First things first. I will look for gold and make sure I apologize to her. Get her to meet with Barry face to face. So that we can trash this thing up once and for all. I mean, I'm supposed to be working on my wedding. We're supposed to be planning, not being distracted by all this. You know? First thing, daybreak. I'll sort this out once and for all. First thing, daybreak. I'll sort this out once and for all. You see him, follow him, and do not stop until I ask you to. Okay, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Yes, okay, that's him, that's him. But wait, let him pass. Follow him, follow him. This can't go on. I can't let this continue. Not when it's obvious that my man spent the whole of yesterday and last night thinking and worrying about the bitch and not me. Yes. How else can one explain the fact that the first thing that he did this morning was to leave his house, drove here to meet her? I don't care to know what they are discussing anymore. This has to stop. Please. Mr. Bond, please, please stop standing in my way. Please, please. Look, I, I'm sorry for what happened, okay? Really, really what is this? Please, please, this is embarrassing. Please stand up. Please. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Um, 
kneeling in public before you is embarrassing. I'm on my feet. I'm, I'm sorry. I just want a moment with you, you know, to, to apologize, to have a word with you. Please. Mr. Bond, you did not offend me, so I don't understand all these apologies. Look, I may not have offended you directly, okay, but my, my fiancé did. I mean, in my own house, and that, that makes me, you know, guilty by association. The lady who assaulted me was your fiancé. Yes, uh, I, I suspect um, someone must have seen us together um, the other day and, you know, gave her a false report of what was actually going on. You mean both of you have an No, event? no, I, I, I kicked her out of the house immediately you left. I, I, I told her I never wanted to speak with her again. Mr. I, Bond, why? I was upset, okay? I, I was upset. I, I told her to find you first and apologize. Now I realized I went overboard and that may escalate things even further. But now I just want to apologize for everything that happened and to also plead with you to, you know, meet with her, have, have a conversation with her, please. Mr. Bond, that won't be necessary, okay? I need to speak to Lucy urgently. Yes, I need her to advise and help me on my next and I would advise you stop coming. Barry is pregnant. I need you guys to do a very clean job for me. Make it very, very smooth. Okay? Okay. Let me send you the pictures. Okay. And the video to make it very clear. Okay. I've sent it. Alright. Uh, where you go? <laughs> well, you can trust us. I'll be waiting for you guys here. You have the whole info, right? Yeah, we've got every info. Alright. Trust your voice. Bond, why has he been calling me repeatedly? Should, should I pick? No, 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 no. I will not pick this call. Whatever he has to say, we'll wait. Mm -hmm. I need to handle this tax myself. I need to fix our relationship. It's very important. I'm sorry, baby. I won't pick this call. Oh, let me even put it on silent. Sorry, I love you, but this car has to wait. Sorry. Others here. 
Why don't you not tell us say you go kill him now, eh? Kaka, what you be this now? Ooh. So what next? I need you to pick up her body, put it in the trunk of her car, huh? take her in the middle of the city. I am very much interested of people discovering her body and the news of her death spreading everywhere. To what end? What's the extra drama for? Why? Your own is to take order. I give the order, complete the tax, and come and take your money. Small car, this girl, car, this girl, car, this girl. That's a bad man, Kevin, all this one. It calls from you, baby. <laughs> I said I'll be done with what I'm doing before I will answer you. What is it? Why are you in a hurry to talk to me? Hmm? Now I am done. Let's talk. Hi, baby. Oh, I'm so sorry. My phone was actually inside my bag. No, 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 no. I went for morning mass. Yes, and after which I met with the priest uh, so that I can do counseling. Oh. Oh, you'll be coming to my house soon. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, baby. I'll be waiting for you. All right. See you soon. Love you. <laughs> Let's see what you have to say. I mean, she was in distress. Couldn't even utter her word. All she did was, you know, you know, give me a sign that she needed to use an inhaler. And I thought to myself quickly, you know, the closest pharmacy is it's not so close. I remember my my sister, she's asthmatic and she left one of her inhalers in the house. So I thought to myself, you know, I need to just quickly take her to the house to administer that to her first. It so happens that that little action Saved her life. I mean, I, I was going to come to yours afterwards, but she called me insisting she wanted to return the inhaler. Of course, I, I, I said no, that it was okay. She could keep it, but she insisted. and said, like, it's okay. In fact, she was about leaving when you showed up. Phoebe, <clears throat> she means to say that the lady I met in your house is nothing to you but a lady in distress that begged you to help her on your way to my house to tell me that your trip to Abuja was cancelled. Yes, Barry. Yes. Oh my gosh. But really, why do you need to call me? Oh, but I was already on my way to you, you know. I, I, I wanted the whole surprise thing, you know, make it fun, even have real breakfast at, at yours. I blame myself equally. I, I, I should have handled things differently. I'm sorry, it's okay. Okay. Babe. It's fine. I mean, I, I, I saw it this morning um, after morning um, jogging routine. I apologized. I apologized on your behalf and um, I told her, you know, We'll come see her later, you know, so that both of you can close this ugly chapter of misunderstanding. It's the reason I came to pick you up. Pick me up? Yes, yes, yes. She's um, doing something for her fiancé. I mean, he has this building she's working on as a supervisor. She's supposed to be there to receive materials from a supplier. In fact, she should be there already. Um, we, could, we could go right away. Hmm? Yes, 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 let's go. Let's go, you, 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 you're okay to go, you're good to go. We should go? Yeah, 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 let's go, come on. Come, come, it's all right. Don't beat yourself too hard.
Um, dear, we are here to see Miss Gold. Miss Gold? You mean my cousin? Oh, she's oh, a cousin. Oh, are you the Thai supper that has been calling me on phone? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, I'm a friend. Uh, I'm here on appointment to meet with her, together with my fiancé. Um, my name is Bond. Oh, well, I'm sorry. She has not been here today at all. That's strange, but she told me um, she was going to be here. In fact, she should be here like an hour ago. You know, you are right. Because I myself was actually getting worried just before you came in here. Because she ought to be here by now. Even the supplier that she's, that she's supposed to come here with has been trying her line and it has been saying switched off. <sighs> switched off? How is that even possible? Uh, maybe she lost her phone or something. Is it ringing? Switched off. Um, you know what? We'll just head to the hotel. If she shows up, just let her know we, we dropped by and we headed to the hotel. Right. I'll do that. Okay. 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 It's actually... What's that number switched off? It makes absolutely no sense. What could have happened to Gold? Her phone is switched off. She's nowhere to be found. She's not even at her, uh, her fiancé's building site. And the people at the hotel, they said they haven't seen her since her uh, morning routine. How did she just vanish into thin air? Baby, don't you think you're worrying for nothing? And what exactly is the meaning of that? What I'm saying is that haven't you considered maybe the consent that you said she gave to you for both of us? To me, it was not real. Yes. I mean, maybe she said that to get you off her face. Then switched off her phone the moment you guys parted with. Went somewhere cozy to relax. Yes, I mean, she's an adult. She might think there is no need for her to prolong this whole thing since you've explained everything to her. Apologized on my behalf. You even went ahead to explain to her that you're going to find me, make up with me, then focus your energy on our making our wedding to work. On hearing that she might decide there is no need for all these things, she decided to move on. Let's say I go with the possibility of your theory. How then do you explain the fact that she did not show up to receive the supplier at the site? Tell me, would she jeopardize work just because she wanted to work? Exactly my point. People are wet. I mean, you don't even know this lady. You don't know her. You've explained everything to her. And to me, that is all that matters. End of story. Look, I really don't know what to think right now, but one thing for sure, I am famished. <sighs> Same here. So let me go in there. Make something for us to eat, okay? Come. <laughs> I won't take long, okay? Come in.
was robbed. I was robbed on the way. How did that happen? Are you, are you all right? Is everything okay? They took my car at gunpoint and everything else inside. I am so, so sorry. Thankful nothing happened to you. Man, such incidents, they, they, they usually end up worse. You know, fatal. Some people lose their lives. Thank you. I've made I've made the necessary reports at the police station. Then I left for the site. And getting to the site, the security man at the site told me that he came with some lady. I guess it's your girlfriend. Yes, yes, um myself and my fiance we Great to see you. I, I'm sorry. It must have been a really, really scary experience for you. I am traumatized. I'm, so I'm talking about my fiance. She's she's in the kitchen cooking something. Um, let me get her. Um, Barry. She's left the premises. That's not possible. I mean, she's in the kitchen cooking. Give me a minute. Babe! Guess who's here? Babe? you would not want to hear the reason I am calling you on the phone. I said, where the hell are you? Do not dare me before I unleash my anger on you. Where the hell are you? Okay, fine. I'll meet you there. Hey, why are you calling me? Hey. Oh, I cannot pick this call. I can't pick this up. I'm sure that bitch might have told him everything. Now you won't only she's hung on me. No, no, I can't pick this up. I have to put this phone on silence. What would I do? <laughs> Obi, come, 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 come. Okay. Uh, did you see Barry? Barry? Barry. Yes. Uh, uh, yellow Barry. Y yes, I, I see him. But I know see him. Listen, Oga, Obi, I, I am not in the mood for your lousy talk. Have you seen Barry or not? Oga, no be joke, I joke. I know they talk and make it sweet you because I know say nothing go sweet you. The, the guy run, where, where Barry run come up for this uh, compound? Eh? He rich many people gather cry for him. He be like, say, Osama Bin Laden, they enter the house. My friend, keep quiet. So you're saying you saw Barry leave this compound? Okay, you know they understand this thing where they talk. He no leave the compound. Now run and run, come out for the compound. He just run, just, ah, come out. Me safe, I wonder. It's okay, it's okay. Go. But, Oga... Okay, okay. That's enough! Okay, no, Professor. Thank you, sir. Switched off a line after 
targeting several missed calls from me. Okay. Now my salary thief. He consigned me too. Now my salary. Now my salary thief. This guy is a thief. Today I'm waiting. Today I'm 23rd. 23rd. Hey! Notes don't end. Oga! Okay. Oga, okay, this matter consigned me too as a security officer. Make I call my senior colleagues them. They don't take my salary. My fiance is not having any of those explanations that I was robbed. He believes that I planned it all simply because I had some millions with me that was meant for the contractor at the site. You being serious right now? Who kind of a man would think that of someone he's getting married to? I am shocked as well. Then he called off our engagement and told me to leave his hotel. I mean, that, that is outrageous. What manner of man is that? You know, but let me have his number. I, I, I'll speak with him. No, no, please. No. I don't want to compounding issues for me. He's already accusing me of having an affair. He believes that I planned and executed everything with him. Imagine calling him when you're not one of my relatives that he knows. What do you think that would happen to me? He doesn't even want to speak with my parents. That's, that's unfair. It's really, really unfair. What is the plan? What do you want to do now? I don't know. I am confused. I can't think out of the box right about now. I, I don't know what to do. Please help me. Help you? How? Accompany me to the hotel to get my luggage before his brothers get into town. I don't want them creating a scene. They're already threatening me on the phone. I need to get my things out before they get into town, please. And help me beg your woman that I stay here for some couple of days. I, 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 need to, I need to find myself. My emotions are all over the place. Please, I promise to leave after some couple of days. Please help me. I don't, I don't even know what's going on with my fiance. I, mean, I have no clue. She will return your calls. But you have to help me first. Officers, look at what they did to my sister. <laughs> Just look at what they did to my sister. Can you now believe us? You can see her corpse. She's dead. The police are actually taking her corpse away to the mortuary. So why don't you believe? Take me out of here. What crime did my sister commit to warrant this kind of wickedness? Okay. <laughs> this is unbelievable. Good, 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 good. No, no, I didn't expect this. I didn't expect this. Go, 
good. Why are you? Why are you? We are members of the Nigerian Police Force. We have an emergency on our hand. Uh, I would like to seek for your help. Just yes, uh, we need to move a corpse to the mortuary. A corpse? Yes, of course. Please. Barry. Barry, 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 Pico. Tell me what is going on, God damn it. I said she bashed into my hotel room here in Abuja. I was about to get into the bathroom. Yes, Barry, she came with a dagger. I still can't explain how I made it out of that laser life. The most frustrating part of it was she chased me out of the room to the road. Yes, Barry. I kept pleading with the hotel people to stop her, to rescue me. But they kept looking at me as if I was mad or something. They didn't do anything to help me, Barry. Stop blabbing, Barry. And tell me what the hell is going on before... Chief advisor, you advised and planned with Barry to murder me. I'm sorry. It is too late for apologies. If I had wanted to kill you, I would have done that right in the hotel. I wouldn't have let you make it alive. What, what do you want from me? Leave for Enugu at once. And do not change into any outfit except what you have on. If you do so, I will strip you naked and drag you on the streets of Enugu. Again, I will make sure I kill you in the presence of your family and take every soul in your family along with me. Please, please, please. Okay, okay I will obey you. I will obey you. I will not wear anything else. I'll just go like this to Enugu. But please don't kill my family, please. Don't kill anyone. Leave at once. Oh, okay. okay. I will obey you. I will not wear anything else. Oh, please don't, 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 don't kill, kill, kill anyone in my family. Oh. Leave! Oh, okay. <laughs> I can't hear you. You're in a noisy place. Hello, Lucy. Lu Lucy, I can't hear you. Hello. I can't hear. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. You dare get to that door. Barry. You will not be running outside. But you'll be going straight to hell. And your family will be right behind you. Yeah. I'm not running again. I'm not running again. I'm not running again. Please, I'm not running again. Please don't have my family. Please, I don't want to die. Please. Please. I heard you asking Lucy. Your partner in crime. Your chief advisor. What both of you have gotten yourselves into cannot be phantomed even in your deepest imagination. Please, please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Do 
to think that you didn't give me ample time to explain myself. No, you didn't. But here you are, begging and crying. You know what? I will listen to you. I will give you all the time. But just so you know, your tears and your apologies will be like screaming in the wind. Please, I beg you. Please, I beg you. I didn't know about you until, until it was too late. It was, it was, this my friend that misled me. She's the one that pushed me into this whole thing. Please, please don't kill me here. Don't kill me, please don't kill me. Don't kill me. Like I said earlier, your tears and apologies will go with the wind. And that is exactly what just happened. Return yourself to Bond's house. Now. Hmm? Please. Please. Please, I think of there, please. No. Oh, don't kill me, please. Now. Oh. You think he knows? No, he doesn't. I didn't tell him that you murdered me. And I would advise you don't do the same too. Else. Oh, you feel so haunty, Barry. I will kill you slowly. I. I won't. No, I won't. I won't tell him. But we. We won't tell him anything. Please, I don't want to die. I don't want to die, please. Please. Don't pick his calls or return them up until you get there. Leave at once. Now! just left without saying anything to me. What happened? Slap him. What is wrong with you? You're acting weird. Do it. You okay? And now? Baby, is everything okay? Is everything okay? <laughs> Stupid or something. What is wrong with you? What has come over you? Again. Again. Are you are you trying to get yourself killed? What has come over you? Are you are you mad? You know what? Not let you push me into doing something I would regret. No. Leave my house. Leave my house this minute before I, I, I tear you apart. Leave my get out. This minute! Leave my house! Mad woman! What nonsense! I'm sorry, Bond. I heard voices. 
No, it's um, nothing. Nothing to worry about. Okay. I'm done. I'm done freshening up. Thank you for letting me use the guest room. That's no problem. Um, so, um, I will make you something after bringing your luggage in. You... You mean you want to bring my luggage into the house? But I thought the plan was to leave them open till we get to your fiancé's house and... <sighs> Anyways, I doubt if she's going to accommodate me. Um, I changed my mind. Um, you, you'll be staying here. I, I, I don't understand. I mean, uh, it's simple. Uh, you won't be staying at Barry's. You stay here in my house. You are a welcome guest. In fact, you can stay for as long as you want. The guest room is yours. Or do you have a problem with that? No, 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 not at all. Thank you. But, but what about her? Don't worry about Barry. This is my house and you're my guest. Okay? Give me a minute. for me. to yourself. You are a ghost. Shut up. Bond is alive. I mean, how can a living man 
get married to 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 to, to, to a court. Shut up. And by the way, how will he know? He will never know. And I believe that you won't spill. Hence, I will kill you and wipe out your family. Please don't do that. I'm carrying his child. For the sake of this baby, please. Don't harm me, don't kill me. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry, please. Please just forgive me. Because... He's at the door. Hmm? Who? Personal belongings are in there. I do not ever want to see you in my house again. Do you hear it? Don't, 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 don't touch me. Don't touch me. Baby, please. Don't do it for me. Please do it for our baby. Please don't leave me. Barry, I am not a violent man. Otherwise, I would have beaten you up to a pulp. Never want to see you again. Please, Bond. 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 Oh. God. God, please help me. It's just a little mistake. Please help me. I'm sorry. yourself heal for the sake of your mental health. It happened so fast. Nothing, not, nothing prepared me for it. I I never dreamt that it would come so soon and that I would be made to embark on it in such a cruel manner. understand what you just said. life that you did so cruel it healed you and you know wipe all the pain away <sighs> I 
you are still not making sense to me. I'm confused. Stop in here. We are not in Enugu now. I, I know, but my house is in a street just down the road and not here. I know, but I'm going no further. Get down. But we agreed that you were going to take me into my compound. I don't. I said get down. Oh, come on, sir. Be reasonable. Eh? Am, am, I, am I going to just come down here? How do I explain to my neighbors that I'm just very. Just a towel, a single towel. That's not fair. Just please, eh? Do you want to continue this journey stuck naked? Sleep. It's past one a.m. Sleep eludes me. That's sad. It's the same for me. You too. Yeah. I even tried, you know, walking around the house, hoping to tie my legs and my mind. That would in turn help me sleep, but um, nah. I noticed the light from your room and I decided to come check up on you. Why? I, I, I can't sleep. I, I, I feel pains. I feel. I feel excruciating pains. 
Why? Why are you unable to sleep? Sleep is the child of a peaceful mind. Those were the exact words of my father, you know. I'm just getting to grasp the full meaning of it. Oftentimes you you speak in parables. It's, your words confuse me. I, The thing is, you should I be. I shouldn't be, you know, using words that will confuse you even more. I should be helping you pick up the pieces. I understand that. Uh, believe me when I say we're in this together. Barry and I, we're done. Yes, I mean, it's been a toxic ride, and I... Let's just say I pushed the exit button. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm... I'm so sorry, I didn't... We can talk about it, right? Please sit. Sit, please. Lost appetite as well. Please don't do that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You don't have to be sorry. I should be the one apologizing for coming into your life and shattering it. No, don't, don't do that. It's going to make my mood even worse. I mean. You didn't do anything. It's not your fault. It's not your fault you, you you had an attack when you did. It's not your fault you were on that street. It's certainly not your fault that I drove past when I did and stopped to help. And you definitely, definitely can't blame yourself for Barry's actions. You know what I thought you would be that crazy. I mean, even coming to my house the other day and, and slap me it makes absolutely no sense. So please do not blame yourself. Your heart bleeds for her. My heart bleeds for my fiance as well. Despite everything they've done to us, our hearts still yearn for them. But the truth is, we can't possibly continue this way. You know, you're right. You, you came to me for emotional healing and. Look at me now, needing to heal myself. 
Ah, oh, sweet. We need to get away. You know? Go someplace else. Away from this city. This house. The people we know. Are you saying we temporarily relocate to somewhere and... and uh, do some healing together. And please don't say anything. Oh my God. Oh please God, what's going on? You're awake. Mama? Mama? Mm. Yes? Mama is awake. Mm. Are you okay? It's okay. Sorry. Sorry. My name is Sujuago. And this is my daughter, Neka. We saw you at the bush side. It's like you are attacked by hire killers. And we decided to bring you home and give you little treatments. Thank God you have regained your consciousness. I remember, I remember, I remember. What did you do to them? And why are they after your life? Who would have wanted you kill? Barry. Berry? Berry. 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 Who is Berry? Berry. He tried to kill me. Why would the person try to kill you? What did you do to the person? She's my ex. She's my ex. Ex? She's trying 
it. It's okay. Just relax. This is my house. And you are safe here, okay? Please. I'm sorry. My daughter and I will take good care of you. Sorry. But where did you come from? Who are your parents? Just tell us about yourself, okay? Please say something. You can trust us. Just. Crazy Chaka. It is done. Bond is dead. <laughs> when will you start seeing the shadows under your nose? Bond is very much alive. No. That's not possible. I killed him and I watched him die. So... Go and finish what you have started. My spirit will take you to where he is and make sure you leave no stone unturned. Go! to you. All I know is that my God is on your side. Definitely he will fight your battle for you. All you will do for me is to be strong, forge ahead to meet a better future. Okay? Don't worry, you'll be fine. God is with you. Even scarier. She she came after two of us. Yes, with physical and diabolic powers. What? Why would your fiance do such a thing? Besides, I, 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 I thought you had told her about me. There are several happenings between the two of us that I haven't told you about. Several happenings? Does it mean this is the reason of your sudden change of mind about me moving in with her? Yes. Look, I'll tell you everything, okay? Um, when I get back, I, I need to I need to speak with my keeper. Sorry, your gates, man. Yes. Please, sir, tell me, are we in any? 
Are we in any danger? No, 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 no. no. So please tell no. me that. No, not at all. Um, just um, precautionary measures. Obi? 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 Oh. Oh, no. Okay, I'll get Oh. Oh. Okay. Girl, this one, this one, Jesha. They call me like this. Bless me and you, they get the same bad dream. That's all. That's all. Obi, 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 look, I am not in the mood for your silly talks, okay? I need you to listen to me. Do you hear me? I need you to pay attention to what I'm about to say. Uh -huh. Okay, I am standing attention. Okay. Good. I do not want you to let anybody that comes visiting in, okay? I am not around. Not even if they call you over the phone. Okay, there's nothing waiting. I had a dream for, 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 for my dream. That's all which is always address the enter people's phone. They, they will you people. shut it for a minute? Listen, if you continue with this nonsense talk of yours, I will slap you into permanent deafness. Ah. Oh, God. Now listen to me. I do not want to repeat myself again. I do not want to see anybody, not even if they call you over the phone. Are we clear? Good. Now, I'll also be switching off my phones. Okay. If you need anything, you come through the back door. Okay. It's good. It's good. We switch off our phones eh, so that all these switches that wizards will respect themselves. Eh? But, Oga, okay, this one is saying I follow back door. The only thief they follow back door. Eh? The only thief they follow back door. Me, I be security man. This one where they don't they disturb for phone. If I follow back door now, if you shoot me, Think he's a busy, which is always away from food come out. I don't really like all this thing now. And and okay, the information self no complete. Eh? You, you know if you tell me what I want here, you just say my follow back door, come. No problem. Go inside your room, lie down, continue the the dream. Make I go inside, continue my own dream. Me and you, we go see for dream. If we enter inside now, I go begin the dream, you go start your own. We go link up through Bluetooth. Since now the same dream, phone dream with the dream. They don't set up my Nokia touch, which is how much I'm coming. They destroy everything. It's too much self for this dream. Huh? She can't work with this. She can't work with this. It is too much. It is too much. Eh? Come on, 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 come on,
please. Please, 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 please. This place is not like normal lady. Normal lady for this kind of place. More go! Oh my god, where am I? Oh my god. I feel my girlfriend is my girl. What is happening to me? Oh where should I go to? The car tracks. Who is there? Who is there? What's this guy? Who is there? Who? Who? I got no Hey, it's me, Chicken. Hey, Chicken. Open the gate. 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 Chicken. No need. No need. No need. No need. See, revise her like this. Why? You now nah, back you go they go, I got no deal. Ah. I got no deal. Ah. But but this is burnt card I'm seeing there. You see? You see, this is the problem. I, I, I have this is why they have problem with people. Whenever they do this my security work, this is why they have problem with people. No spoken. No spoken. You day here. I tell you so I got no deal. You look inside me, you know whether you there or you know there. He be your friend, he be my organ. Me and him, who they who they close pass? My friend, will you open that gate? What is wrong with you? I'm going to be coming down. Defensive game, defensive game, defensive game, defensive game. Open this gate. You know who you are dealing with. You don't know me again. Eh? Who are you? Bond's friend. Bond's friends. Eh? Me, I be boss GM. Boss GM. Gate man and general manager. I think you say, okay, no, they, you see, they, 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 they look inside. Okay, they open the gate. What is wrong with you? Okay, what is wrong with you? <sighs> Not only one car, my okay, gate. Let me ask you. You know how many cars when they come here carry my yoga that's not truck, eh? So many of them. Well, I, I I don't actually blame you. I don't blame you. I blame whoever kept you here. Idiot. Blame her. Then they call you chicken in a goli. Then they call you chicken. Other people when they answer chicken, they sing. You see chicken when they sing, they're responsible. Look at you. So you they insult my yoga. My yoga is a poor man to you, Abi. So my yoga no fits. My yoga no fits carry uh, urban. Urban drivers they come here carry my yoga. They, 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 they insult my my yoga. She leave this door open. Oh God. Lucy. Lucy. Why did she live everywhere like this now? Lucy. Lucy. Feel good and her mischief everywhere. No, no, I can't stay in this house. Hey! What is it? Huh? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't mean to start with you. Wait, Lucy. 
Where are you coming from? On barefoot. Barry, she won't, she won't believe what happened to me. I actually woke up in a refuse dump. I woke up in a refuse dump in the full glare of everyone. They were all staring at me. Trust me, Barry. I had to run out of there in shame. I, I had to just run out of that place like a raving, mad. What? What, 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 is, what is it? What, 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 what is it? Did you see? Wait. You mean you woke up in a refuge dump? That's what I just said. I woke up in a refuge dump in the full glare of everyone. That means you actually had a very perfect night's nice sleep. Baby girl, I woke up inside the casket shop. <gasps> inside the coffin. Like I woke up as the third person. Babe. Barry? Barry? Is she here? Barry! You're telling me that you woke up in a... It's your fault! It was all your fault. Yes. It's all your fault! What are you even talking about? What is wrong with you? Because of you, I lost my relationship. I lost the love of my life! Snap out of it, Barry! What is wrong with you? I did you a favor! I showed you! I opened your eyes! Hey, shut up! What are you saying, Barry? What the hell are you talking about? This is a favor that made me to lose my worthies! I lost my marriage because of this favor you're talking about! Because of friends like you! People no longer tell their friends the truth! Nobody wants to tell anyone the truth because of people like you! What friend? You're not a friend! I did you a favor! You're not my friend! I did you a favor, Mr. Barry! Will you I did you a favor! No, you dare to help me! Stop what is wrong! I did you a favor! 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 I
is deliberately hiding something. And listen, listen and listen very carefully. Mr. Bond is at home and he is not alone. Um, I, I, I don't get any of the thing you're saying. Please, who is born with and why is born his gate man and the same fellow that he is with hiding things from people? Even me that is his closest friend. Why is he hiding things from, from me? If you are indeed a close friend to Mr. Bond, go to his house right now and do whatever you will do to gain access to his house. Find out what is going on. And please, use the back door. Do not knock before getting in, into the house. That I should use the back door, I shouldn't knock with that b before entering Bond's house. I don't understand. Please, who are you? What are you saying? Mr. Chike, don't bother knowing who is talking to you. Go to your friend's house because he needs help. I can't, listen, I can't. He just dropped the call on me. I need to call him back. Whoever you are, and whatever information you have, or whatever you are hiding, what is going on? He's born in trouble. Why am I even delay? I need to go and check what's going on. Who be that? Who be that? Let's see, no serious. All this must not sugar. I know they know the company. Who be that? Who they not? So it's true that
TK! How did you even get into the house? No! 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 Just see. friend of mine, I mean, he, he traveled to Canada, what, like, two weeks ago? You know, he was back in the country, and how did he even get into the house without me? Why don't you go off time, please? Uh, um, I will, I'm just in, in, in shock, I'm just, give me a minute. He will never see her again. Not even when he gets back to his house. Not even in his dreams. Obi? 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 Get up, Obi! <laughs> Obi, what happened? What happened? Chike happened. Chike happened. Chike did this to you? Chike? 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 face. Thank you very much. That girl is a ghost. She is dead. What is she doing in the house? Chike, what's your problem? What happened? Bon, I, she, she let you come out alive. You're alive. But what is that even supposed to mean? What is that supposed to mean, Chike? The girl I saw in your house is a ghost. You're a raving madman. A madman, that is what you are. Why, why are you calling me a madman? I'm telling you the gospel truth. She is dead. Look, gold is not dead. And I will not have you talk about a total stranger you know nothing about like that. I know she's a stranger when I met her. She was inside a car. Her corpse was lying down there. They murdered her. They killed her. I know what I saw. What, I know what, what, I, what, 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 what are you even talking? You know what? Come with me. Come with me. Move. Come, move, move, move. move.
Obi! Obi! Okay. 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 Yes. Yes. Naim. Okay. Naim. Um. Did you see gold? Okay. Okay. You, you know, get gold. Na 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 silver. You get. Did you just stop yourself for once? Did you see gold in this compound? Okay. Sorry, sir. Did you see I live in this compound? Okay, I don't see anybody. They manage one. I, I, I don't see. Now you manage this one. So you mean you didn't see her leaving this company? Okay, as a day like this now, I don't even they see you clear. I don't see anybody. Ghost. Um, Chris Chaka. This is one of the many problems Lucy and I came here to solve. I know why you are here. Yes, it's all about the wedding. But in fact, the ritual will take place here. There's going to be an elaborate ritual. And both of you cannot leave this chamber until the ritual is successfully completed. If not, her ghost is angry to do harm to both of you, even to put you to death. Huh. See, you are safe because you are here. Okay, but well, what, what, what do we do now? What should we do to, to complete this ritual really quickly? Let us get down to it. Both of you should undress yourself. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, you mean... Uh... You are going to spend 16 days in this chamber so that her ghost will stop disturbing you. Any more minutes, I will change my mind. Um, 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 sir, we will do it. Eh? Yes, um, we will do it. Let's do it. Yes. Um, <clears throat> uh, let's go, let's go. Do we have a choice? Very well. This is the spot the car was parked. It's um it's a Mercedes Benz GLK 350. That's the exact same car. Gold drives. The same one that was stolen that started the whole problem um, between her. The story doesn't add up. That's not the story. I was coming back from the airport. I saw the whole incident here and I also used my car to carry her corpse to the mortuary. I assisted the police to use my car to carry her corpse to the mortuary. No, oh, this can't be true. Gold can't be dead. It makes absolutely no sense. It's, it's not true. Bro, probably if you hear it from her cousin, you might believe me. You, you met with her cousin? Of course, I did. Um, that same day, I, I saw her cousin. He said he was going to the hotel to look for gold and the whole thing happened. And I was actually on my way to Barry's house. There you go. It makes sense now. This is the reason I've been skeptic about what you've been telling me. Everything you've been telling me. 
Chike, be honest with me. Did Barry put you up to this? Did she cook up this nonsensical story and... and, and, and can, can, you, can you just stop? Stop it! What do you take me for? What do you take me for? Do I look like somebody Barry can pay money to, 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 to bring up a story? What am I going to gain? What will I gain as your friend? I am telling you something that is real and you're telling me that if she, she... Do not insult me. Do not insult me. This is the evidence on my head to show whatever I'm telling you is true. This whole thing is beginning to make sense to me. I think, I think God's spirit is really manipulating you not to believe me. She doesn't want you to believe... She doesn't want you to believe me. But there's no problem. God, wherever you are, wherever you are, it will not be well with you. It will not be well with you. Stop manipulating my friend. Stop manipulating him. If you're a recourse, come out and confront me. Come out. This is all this nonsense. I believe one day you come out of this problem that you're into. This is the same site I came with Barry to meet with Gold to formally introduce both of them to each other. How did you find this place again? Another coincidence. I met with that same guy that said he's Gold's cousin. He said he works in this site. That's the guy. Maybe you talk to him, he might clear your doubts. Clear your doubts. Excuse me. Please, can you honestly tell me what, what happened with gold? I don't know. I can't explain it, it just happened. It's still a shock to me. Gold. It's actually true. It's true. Do you know them? You know my daughter and I? Who is he? And how come you know her names? Of course, who are you? My encounter with gold was so extensive. Thank goodness, it... It's okay, my son. I understand how deeply shaking you are. Realizing you have been sharing your own house with my daughter's ghost. Hey! Please, I apologize for everything. Oh, no, 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 no. no. Mama, there is nothing to apologize for. Nothing. I believe what happened was intentional. Gold wanted me to have those dreams. 
She was trying to pass a message. Um, I believe so. According to what Zako told us I, about her ex who lives in America, how he turned his back on you all after her death. And the cops making it difficult for you all to retrieve her. The cops. It's really crazy. I do believe God is making you meet her family because she wants you to help them. Exactly. Exactly. Um, you said you were going to Enugu to try and retrieve the cops with the police, uh, right? Naka. Yes, I wanted to, but I have to postpone. Why? Because I don't have anywhere to stay. I was counting on sharing stuff at Brother Uzako's house. But they drove him away, so I don't have anywhere else. You can't even afford a hotel at all. You know what, that would be a problem. Um, you can stay at my place. Really? Yes, I mean, absolutely. I, I am sure it's what God would want. Um, you can stay at my place and um, with regards to the corpse, I will step in with the police and make sure it's retrieved in good time. Um, my friend and I will do everything in our power, use all our connections to make sure that the people behind the murder be found and brought to book. Wow. Um, thank you so very much. Thank you. We really appreciate it. So God bless you. Thank you so much, Mr. Bond, for coming to assist us at a time like this. We really appreciate it. Thank you. My sister's stuff here, yeah, and he really hits me hard. It's okay, I, I understand. I'm sorry, but why? Why? Who could have killed her? What was our offense? Like, I just want to know what was our offense that I could not be forgiven. What? Um, I'm so sorry, but I want to assure you that. I will do everything possible to make sure that whoever was behind your sister's death will be brought to book, okay? Good and I were what my mother had. I had to drop out of school to enable her for her own education. My mother did everything to see her through school. Till Brother Mecca came in. They met two months before her graduation. He asked me to sit for the upcoming examination, which I did. And I passed. And he promised to sponsor me through medical school. He was the brother we never had. And it was the son my mother never had. He was very good to us. He was more than a fiancé to my sister. Everything changed when my sister died. He distanced himself from us. He abandoned us. He doesn't talk to us anymore. He keeps blaming my sister for her own death. Reason, he asked her to stop jogging in the morning because of this security in the city. He could not even help us secure our sister's body from the defeated barrier. When I 
nicely. I don't know. He forgot everything they shared together. How can he treat the memory of a woman he claims he loved like that? Is it because we are poor? What he did was wrong. Really wrong, I mean. Gold deserves more respect. I mean, he... And then stopping Nzako from walking at his sight. He... That wasn't... That wasn't right. So unfair. Could it be that he killed her so that he can start a new life with his secret lover? I don't know. But everybody will be investigated. Just don't try to take your mind off things. Relax and make yourself comfortable, okay? Um, tomorrow we'll go and fetch Gold's corpse. Start making I mean, for the funeral immediately. I already promised your mother that I was going to you know, take care of everything. Okay? Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. And that reminds me, um, with regards to your school, you don't have to worry. You will graduate. I will take care of everything. Okay? Yes, I'll, I'll make sure you and your mother lack nothing as long as I'm alive. Mm. My, oh my God, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Bless you, thank it's, you, thank it's, it's you. All right. It's all right, it's okay. It's the least I can do, it's okay. Just, um... Oh, I don't feel good. Thank you so much, thank you, sir. It, it's thank fine, you. It's, it, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> you give you great. You're welcome. All right, I'll I'll check up on you later. Huh? That's all right. You sure? Yes, Mr. Bond. That's on the side of the police. Uh, now that the documentation is done and duly signed by a family member, we can take you to the mortuary at a time of your choosing so that um, you can, uh, the cops can be formally handed over to you. And um, what are we talking about? We can, you know, we're ready. We can head there right away. Right, Neka. Yes, we're ready. In that case, let's go. One more thing. Getting justice for gold is as important as retrieving our corpse. Please, I want you to spare no effort. Not even funds. If you need any support whatsoever, do not fail to reach out to me. Uh, Mr. Bond, the police we put in our best. Uh, we hope to come out with something good. Let's keep our fingers crossed. Thank you very much. Shall we? Honestly, Gold's funeral yesterday was, was emotionally draining for me. I know. I know. I so felt the same way you feel. But I've never seen you in that mood. 
never seen you pride where you did. Why they cover that babe? Whoever murdered her is so mean. Couldn't help but feel sorry for her mother and her neck. It was really sad to watch them the way they were. So I feel I can't really do enough to help ease the pain. And after helping them find the corpse, and calling the funeral, promising to be there for them. However, and also funding the investigation, still feels like it's not enough. Right? But I, I just feel that's the best thing to do. Though I know. Wherever God is, she'll be happy with you. I'm sure about that. I hope she's resting peacefully. She is. <sighs> Enough of this. <laughs> this funeral talk, bro. Can we just talk about something else? funeral is over, I think it's time for you to find Barry and... Please, 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 JK. I don't want to hear that name. Please. I do not want to discuss Barry. Bon, I know you're angry, but to this extent you're taking into it, it's, it's not healthy. Your relationship with Barry is... It's not a kind of relationship you should just wish away. She's crying your child. And she still has your ring. Look, I do not want to hear that. Please stop. Just, just stop. Have you ever considered that Barry's misconduct might have been manipulated by God? All her misconduct in your house. Have you ever considered that God was the one manipulating everything? Huh? Well, I'm going to jump, jump, just say it. Just saying. Udene Karaka on a mapo zoafo. Hm. Okay, Rule. My daughters, it is done. You are completely free from her torment forever. Now get up. Get up and get dressed. Chaka, I'll do the transfer for you once we get to where there is strong network. Yes, and if what you have just done for us, if it works really well, I promise I will double your fee. In fact, I will triple it. I do not call you my favorite client in the last five years for nothing. I am a Chaka, the lawyer servant of the Red. Anything I say or pronounce, believe it. And you will have it. Thank you. You can go now. Thank you, great one. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs>
you made Ichaka cast a spell on Emeka. The very day I was murdered, Maureen, even as Ichaka told you I was murdered that very day, you told him to go ahead with your evil plan. You erased every memory of me. Why? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. Please. Maureen, you were one of my closest friends. As a matter of fact, you knew the very day I met Emeka. You and I were planning my wedding, Maureen. Why? You just couldn't wait. You couldn't even call Neka, my sister or my mother to commiserate with them. And here you are, cruising in my car. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, God. Please, please don't kill me. Please, I'm sorry. Don't kill me, please. Your jealousy will cost you your life. to hurt you. Please find the place in your heart and forgive me, please. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. She's actually very sincere. She's sorry and I'm sorry too for everything. Please just calm down and, and please forgive her, please. Baby, honey, it's me, your Perry. Baby, honey, it wasn't my dream. It was actually God's ghost that made me do all those things. Even this lab and everything. I didn't do it intentionally. Please. Please forgive me, I'm sorry. Bob, I think she deserves a second chance. Can you just please forgive her? Please. Baby, it's me, your Perry. Oh, Moja is still here. Please, don't cast me away. Well, do we still have a wedding to plan? <laughs> of course. And it's going to be loud. And I hope I still have the position of your best man. And I'm the chief bridesmaid of the year. <laughs> so you're happy like it's your wedding? Of course. It's like my wedding. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Enough of the tension in the room, okay? You know, this is a perfect time for both of you to, you know what I mean? Can you just stop, stop giving me that? It's a low hanging fruit. You guys should go for it. It's it's, it's time for a celebration. Come yes! on, let's just. Um, you know what? Just, just let me just, let's let's go get, let me get to it. <laughs> Now, 
the only water diet. I'll <laughs> drink for two. So, uh, yes, you take for two. <laughs> What's that? And there's a try something. Now, you only want a diet. Can we survive this register? When I when I trust, I trust in you. Can we so survive this ready start? Rest already? Yes, I need to get something at the supermarket. Oh, okay. Let me use the restroom. Barry? Barry? deserve to die earlier. I am saving the best for last. Just kill me. If you don't do it, I will do it myself. <laughs> Mary, you can't possibly kill yourself. Even if you try from now till eternity. You can't hurt yourself until I decide. You only die when you tell the world how you murdered me. And I promise you, Barry, you will suffer before you die. Do it. I will never do it. You must and you will. Now report yourself to the nearest police station. Failure to do so, Barry. I will torture you. Even the air you breathe will become fire. Too hot for you to inhale. 
have treated your case with kids' gloves. Right now, I am dead serious like a heart attack. Just, just, just leave me alone. Leave me alone. Please. There is no peace for the wicked. You know what? Go ahead and do it. Just do it. In fact, I dare you to. Do it! You dare me to do my worst! At once, uh, bro, you, you, you can't think. And why you're not settled? Just relax. How can you tell me to calm down? Really, GK? How do you expect me to be calm? Bro, you. you you can't take any step right now or make any right decision in the kind of state you are. You need to relax. Come I cannot be relaxed. I can't be relaxed, okay? I mean, I've, to, I've tried to reach out everywhere I can. But I can't. Line switched off. Nothing. And she's carrying my unborn child. You expect me to, be, to, to, to remain calm? Born. We've made a report to the police. I'm sure they will find Barry. They'll find her. She, she can't just disappear like that. She can't just miss. She should be found. Please, just relax and calm your nerves down. You're stressing yourself too much. Oh. Officer. Any breakthrough? Yes, Mr. Bond. We found Barry. Really? Where is she? Move. Can we... Officer! Sir! Bring move. her in! Okay. Move! What's the move? Uh, what's, what's going on? Why are you, why are you hey, pointing hey. a gun at her? <laughs> Mr. Bond, behold Barry, the murderer of Miss Gold. I don't, I don't, I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand. What, what are you saying? This is the criminal that killed Miss Gould. No, 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 no. This, this, all this makes no sense to me. Barry. I'm sorry. What? What? what I, I, I don't understand. What? What? What, what are you sorry about? What? What? This is cute. What? 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 Barry. Jesus Christ. Move it. Get up and move. Move it. Babe. Move! Bon, I'm sorry. Bloody criminal.
clearly you are deeply in love with him. No. What are you talking about, Mama? Nika, I've observed you several brooding over that guy for some weeks now. I'm, I'm sorry I didn't tell you. Just that. Nika, no one forces love. It flows on its own, more especially if love comes from the heart. Are you suggesting that I, I follow your heart, my daughter? But please, never you ever try to force yourself on him. If the feeling is mutual, just open up. You have my blessings. Really? Sure, my daughter. Thank you, Mama. Bye. Who is that? Please come in. I'm respecting you. Mama, how's everything? It's okay, my dear. Welcome. Okay, Mama. Good to see you, Mama. What are you doing here? Oh, Mama. I, I came to see you. Wow. Mama, with permission, please. Um, I don't mean to make things awkward, but I will be as clear as I can be. Um, I have grown fond of you. And I, I can say that and I would like to explore the possibilities of us being together and, you know, sharing a lot. Oh, please forgive me. Um, it's fine. You, you can sit. <laughs> sit down. I don't know. I would like to take you out, if that's fine, Mama. Is that okay? Um, um, Mama is here. I'm not sure if she will uh, allow me to go. No. Follow him. For real? Go with him. Thank you. I can now rest in peace, knowing that you and Mama are in good hands. Goodbye. Think before you act, yeah. Cause your anger can turn things around.
你